Hello and welcome back to the 25Ks in GeoGuessr. Today, Montenegro. Ah, I'm really not looking forward to this at all. Um, you can see there, I've played it once sometime in the past. I got 10,000 points. You can have a look at my friends list. Um, yeah. I think we might be here for a while. Uh, honestly, I think Montenegro might be have to think for a bit, but it might genuinely be my least favorite country out of all of them in GeoGuessr. Um, and that does, that does say something, because I dislike quite a lot of countries in GeoGuessr. Um, but Montenegro might be my least favorite out of them all. Um, I hope, I hope we can finish under an hour, but there is no guarantee. Probably that is also the only time I've ever played a Montenegro only map. Of course, I've had it in plenty of other um, maps or seeds, just you know, as one round here or there. But uh, let's just get into it and hope that it isn't too bad. I mean, if we just get Montenegro five times, maybe. All right, let's get going in three, two, one, go. That's not. Um, did I just say if we get Montenegro five times? Of course we get... Uh, if we get Podgorica five times is what I meant. Montenegro is already uh, damaging my psyche. What do we have here? Hotel Oasis. Welcome. Um, yeah. Let's, let's go around. Let's try and see if we can find something. Because this actually doesn't look like the worst of roads. To find information. But that's about all I can say so far. We might still be here for like 10 minutes going down this road without any sign. Or any good sign at least. Oh, what have we got here? Just, you know, there's a curve. Yep, I can see the curve. There's train tracks here. It's something at least, I guess. What was that? Kilometer marker, 150 kilometers. So if I went just, if I just went the other way, 150 kilometers, I'd be somewhere at the beginning of the road. Might be in Pogorica, might be somewhere else. But it looks like, I mean, it's just a feeling, it looks like there's a town back there. Maybe we can get to that and then we'll have some more. Clues, that's just not going to be helpful, is it? No. Eventually. Eventually we'll get somewhere. That was kilometer 149, so I'm actually going in the right direction. So only 149 kilometers to go. What have we got here? What's the name of this town? Uh, okay, this way towards Dreja and Potom, Nenheim. Okay, that does seem like we're close to the Albanian border then. Um, because it's in both uh, Montenegrin and Albanian. Yeah, maybe? No, there's no train tracks here. Where else could it be? Here? There's also no train. Oh, there are train tracks here, but I'm quite fit. Um, what about this? I don't see any train tracks here. Fortunately, and there probably won't be any here either. Right. First possible location, not a success. Wait, uh, no, I checked here. Maybe I should just... For a second check the Albanian side of it. But it doesn't look like I'll find anything. Alright. Uh, there's no more information on that either. Hmm. There's mountains everywhere. We've got the Rijeka Rujela. One of those means river. Probably Rijeka, would be my assumption. 
Hmm. Oh, it's a 148. What have we got? Is that just a building? Yep, that's just a building. Brilliant. I mean, my, my genuine hope is that we don't come near the Indonesia time of, I think it was two and a half hours, and I already cut like 10, 15 minutes out of that, or like sped it up. And there's nothing interesting here. Of course there isn't. Why would there be? Yep, there's a gas station there. I can see it, sign. Yep, there's a town entrance sign. With no further information on what town we're entering. There's the Oasis Hotel. We were thoroughly prepared for this. With a sign about... 10 kilometers, well actually it can't have been that much, like 4 kilometers away. Uh, maybe in town we'll find something that tells us which town it is. It's a very small hope, but if we're lucky, it also doesn't look like a very small town. So... Chances are slightly increased that we will find it on Sui. Um, okay. Once we find a name. Hmm. Oh, that one might be interesting. That way towards Podgorica. That way towards Gorobovci and Hoti. Here's Gorobovci. I don't know where Hoti is. There are train tracks here. We have the Hotel Oasis somewhere here. Yes, okay. We're currently in uh, probably Vuxan Lekichi or Tutsi. One of the two. We started up here somewhere. And a road that went north. Probably here, I would assume. Is there any other place that could even be right? Let me go south for a second. Or two. Or fifty. Right. We go over towards the east. And we have sort of a big curve. Yep. That's this one. There's nothing else that looks like that. So. We should be here. Mm, here. Right, that should be close enough. 20 meters, just about close enough. Alright, that wasn't too bad. This could be... <laughs> Jesus Christ. Okay. I mean, I was expecting this. Hmm. That certainly is a location in Montenegro. There's mountains in the background. As they are pretty much everywhere. That's a cool mountain. Very round. Uh, yeah, there isn't really much you can do in Montenegro landscape-wise. It looks pretty much the same everywhere, except, of course, if you're on the coast and there's water. But I see, and again, Albanian on it as well. Yeah, here we are. Okay. That was surprisingly easy. Now, I'd like to at least find some more exact reference points. Uh, game, please, I'm clicking. Hmm. Okay, it goes a bit more west, and there's the first house. So I'm assuming we are... No, are we here right now? Probably not. But I don't really know where we would be. Right, what do we have here? What is this crossing? It's crossing a river. 
Do we have that river on the map? This. Yeah, okay, that makes sense. Yep. Yeah. It came from up here. Did we go through that U-turn at any point? Because I don't remember. Let me see. Went over a bit more east. And we turned over to the west. I don't think we did, no. It must be just behind this corner. West, I think we should be right right about here. Yeah, and up there's the U-turn. Mm-hmm. But are we here? Are we here? Are we here? There's no way to tell. Um, it's a straight road from here to there, all the way back there. Just a very short, so I think we might be further up here. Yeah, let me go one more look. Yeah, I think that should be good. That should be about as close as I can get it. Oh, just about <laughs> 24 meters. All right, we're hanging in there. That was a surprisingly easy round. And we're in the mountains again. <laughs> so far, I've just gotten really lucky that we got two locations on the Albanian border. Okay, that's a nice, nice uh, lake down there. Again, might be not too difficult to find eventually. But the difficult part is always is <laughs> to start finding any sort of information. Uh, let me have one look. Lakes in Montenegro. Mm, maybe. There's not that many. We're on the wrong side for this one. It could be just over here somewhere. Like maybe this actually. Bay of Kotor. But it looks more like a lake than a um than uh, the coast, so probably not there. Hmm. Going south now. Interesting as well. We have one more quick look. Uh, there's nothing going along this really, so it could be it could be here, in theory. Possible. It could also be up here. That's definitely possible. In both cases, though, I don't really think there's much information here. Though, from what I remember, I think in both cases it might be better if we're going north. Uh, what is that? Ah, oh, I see. Okay. Hmm. I'm tempted to just put a checkpoint here and go back. Just start. This isn't really looking like it's going to become any better. Hmm. All right, we'll get past this turn. Does it look any better? Uh, not really, no. Okay, checkpoint here. Let's try north. Maybe that will get us somewhere. Oh, it doesn't look any better. I'm going to try and have a little bit of patience. Let's see, maybe we can see more of the lake as well. Okay, it just continues. It might actually not be a lake, but just a really large, really large river. Hmm. Are there any really large rivers in uh, Montenegro? I don't know. Hmm. 
Um, I wonder as well, because rivers tend to... I mean, maybe, I guess this kind of looks like a river, if you look at the part up here. Is there anything else river-like that goes through here somewhere? No, not at all. We've got like small rivers here or there, but this one actually. But there's no road here that fits. Other than that, potentially, but that doesn't that also doesn't fit. Um so yeah. I still feel like this is the only real location that makes sense. But I gotta get some confirmation. And if I continue going north, then I'm at a dead end. For God's sake. Um, I mean, this fits actually with this. If you look over there. And there's one road that goes north, would cross the, the river, and there's one road that kind of goes, continues over there, and then goes south, maybe? Hmm. Could be. And if we go back here, I mean, I don't think, though, that that matches up, really. Or it could have been this, it could have actually been this one that I saw. And we, we're here currently, and we're now going down this road. Go a bit up again. And we should hit a curve and it should go south pretty sharply. Yep. All right. Okay, then I can go back to the start. I can think about where this could be. Now, let me actually go south a bit here and see if I get a U turn. Well, this is now going east and not south. Uh, so I think we're already past that. Although, where, where is all of this? I didn't see any of this. Let me go north. Instead. See if I get to a U-turn here. Mm. No. Not really. Still going kind of north and then going over to the east, uh, to the west and north, and then just following this road, and then I'd already be up here. Um, this is a problem because that would then mean it can't, it can't be here, even though like everything else fits absolutely perfectly. But if the road isn't there, then it's not there. Hmm. Big problem is just that was my one hope that it would be here. Where else is it supposed to be? Because I've essentially excluded everything else. Hmm. Yeah, it just keeps going south. I mean, it could be here instead. And that that was what we saw there at the end. Doesn't seem great. It might be possible. Because again, I mean, where else is it supposed to be? Can't be down here. Really can't be anywhere else. Uh, but this would... Eventually, all just go west. Let me go back to my checkpoint. We are heading west here. Hmm. Okay, there is a bridge here. Rieka Vrbnica, Udany, and Prievo. Camp Vrbnica in five and a half kilometers. Mm. There isn't really anything like that here. We 
point. No. Hmm. And over here, maybe also no. What were the other things? Rievo. Udan. Hmm. Can't see any of those. Maybe it is over here after all, somewhere. That doesn't really make sense. Hmm. This doesn't make sense either. Somewhere like here, also no. Ah, uh, Montenegro. Anywhere up there? Any rivers here? Not one with a road that fits. Nope. Probably also no. What was it, Vrubnissa? Uh, I mean, can it, it has to be here somewhere, surely. Hmm. That camp is not something that's showing up. Any of this is. The, there we go, there's the camp. Um, but all the other stuff is not showing up either. Rijeka Vrbnica. Not there. Hmm. I guess we're going to have to continue. That is a U-turn over a small river, though. Maybe, like, if I just follow this, and if it is somewhere here... This? I mean, there's no river on the map, and I didn't see any houses. <laughs> I don't know. This, maybe? Is there a road? I mean, there is a road that goes over there. What else can I do, really? Continue and then eventually you still find nothing. Uh, but that's, I guess, what we're gonna do. Like, there's one thing if you, um, you know, if you really have no other option to find anything else, but I do still have the option. I can continue going this way. And this is kind of still a lake, I think. So, or slash river. So it should be visible on the map, I'm pretty sure. Is there anything where it goes around the lake like that? Uh, anything over here, maybe? Something? Not really, no. Not even not really, just not at all. There's no road here if I zoom in very far. No. Anything else over here? No. Just no. Mm. No, I don't think. No, that doesn't make any sense either. I was thinking maybe this was left and we just crossed this bridge. Because that actually fits um, in terms of road directions around here. But I don't know if any of, the, any of this up here fits, and I don't think it does. And none of the things we saw on the sign are here either. Uh, so we continue. Eventually there's going to be something. There's got to be, or there's going to be another dead end, in which case I'm just going to give up. But I'm not giving up until I have no other choice.
This gives us another good look at the lake slash river. Hmm. What if I zoom out all the way here? This is purely based on shape. I mean, shape-wise, this looks pretty good. It obviously can't be it because there's no bridge crossing this, this thing here, but the shape of it is not bad. And it's way too populated as well. Um, no, obviously not. This again has a good shape, but it doesn't fit. Um, there are simply no other lakes here. There simply aren't any. I've now looked through all of Montenegro a bunch of times, and there's still none. It's just, it still can't be anything else, oh, anywhere else but here for me. All right, I mean, we just jumped past that, I guess. Oh, people. Population. Please, a city name. Something. Uh, glu Glushina? Something like that? Wait, that's... Wasn't that the G? Let me look through some other uh, city names here. Is What else could it... Was it a P? Yeah, it was a P. Okay, so it's... Ushini. Something. I don't actually know what that sign means. I'm just assuming what it could be. I could also try and look for that. I'm gonna find that somewhere. Yeah. Oh, it's a Z. The Plutzine. Senior. Is it something that's that's here somewhere? No. What if I just zoom out and just look at? All of Montenegro. Ignoring all of the, the lake river shenanigans. There it is. Yeah. Wait, how does how on earth would that make sense? Oh this road. There it is. Okay. Okay. That still somewhat looks wrong to me, but it's I know it's the right place. Like, not in that sense. Um, but it looks wrong in a way that it doesn't quite look like the ma uh, like the lake I'm seeing here. But that's fine. And where are we exactly? Like here? If I go over here. No, we can't be here. Continuing east. I want to see when that, you know, drop south comes. Eventually, like this one is probably it. Is it? No, this is this one. It might be here, actually. If I go north here. We should get to a turn towards the west. Yes. Yep. That's it. All right. And we are pretty much exactly like here. Right? Yeah, it's hard to tell. Maybe like over here. Yep. All right. <laughs> that was more of what I expected in Montenegro. Okay, Sutvara. Who's on the other side of that? Doop. Sutvara and Dup. Do I want to just have a quick look? I mean, there is a lake over there as well. Unfortunately. Uh, Sutvara and Dup. Will they stand out? Mm, no. Not immediately. 
What about in here? Uh, Sutvara. And there's dupe. Yeah, now the question is... Where exactly? And I need one reference point. I know from where I can look. Is that Zrukva something Yovana? It would be up here. This? Does that lead to the church? I don't know. I could do. Does we just go through this? Okay, let me go. Actually, set the checkpoint because why not? Right. Obviously, this this is not on the map. This, I mean, it's not really a river. I guess it depends. It looks like a river to me, but it might be dried out in the summer. Uh, but the could be, what could it be? It's almost a bit like a U-turn, like here? Or here, maybe? Where else could it be? That, maybe? What happens if I go south? It goes east. Southeast, pretty much. And then there's another turn that's almost kind of like a U-turn. It would be... No, uh, no. Okay. Actually, so maybe it's this one. Then we go southeast, and then there's this turn. Yeah, that would make sense. Now, if we just have two churches up here... Then everything would be fine. It's not a church. Okay, that is a church, though. It's at least a sign towards a church. I can't see the church. That is a church. That is another church. Good. We have to be here, then. And this has got to be the road. So, actually... Even further, like, we have to be here. Alright. Not too difficult. We spawned right next to the city entrance signs. Oh god. Right. We'll see. That is not even a lake. I mean, I'm assuming there's probably a river down there somewhere. I'd be surprised if there wasn't. Oh. Well, call me surprised. There is no river. Hmm. Well, this could take a while. Pretty long while. This is probably the main reason why I hate Montenegro. It's just mountain roads in the middle of nowhere. And it's not even a case of you'll never find information. You will find information eventually. But just not in a reasonable time frame. Not within five minutes. Definitely not within three minutes. Hmm. It doesn't look completely desolate. I mean, there's some houses here. There's some roads going off of them. If we're lucky, it might only take like five or six minutes until we find something. Hmm. And the thing is, like, you know, with, with other countries, there's stuff you can learn, like phone codes or... I don't know, other things, like where's the Google Street View coverage. You can't really learn any of that from Montenegro, because as you can see here, there's nothing here. Like, it's not even like there are signs which you can, you know, where you can get some information from them. No, there's nothing. We've got landscape. That's it. Eventually, maybe we'll find some place. Once you find sit... Was there something there? Or just my imagination. 
Yep. Once you find city names, uh, it's not too hard anymore. Because the country is relatively small. Um, <clears throat> that being said, you have to zoom in pretty far to see some city names. Um, but yeah, definitely getting information at all is 100% the most difficult part in Montenegro. <clears throat> And yeah, it's definitely that it, it looks the same pretty much everywhere that makes it more difficult to um to kind of you know go by landscape or go by anything else rather than just signs. And I know I'm, I'm saying it looks the same everywhere. Of course it doesn't look the same everywhere. Um, but what I mean whenever I say it looks the same everywhere, what I mean by that is it has the same geographical features in every part of the country. Now, of course, there's mountains and there's valleys and there's some flatter areas, but those occur in all parts of Montenegro. So just by, you know, being like, hey, there's some mountains around here, I can't narrow it down to any area of Montenegro. I can probably exclude some areas. I can exclude like the coast. I can exclude like maybe like down here or something, because that I think is very flat. But other than that, it st could still be anywhere in the country. And you can't just look for one random road in a whole country unless the country is like, I don't know, Monaco, I guess. Um, what have we got here? Uh, it might actually be a sign that tells you, hey, if you you know go this way, you'll get to these towns. If you go that way, you'll get to that town. But if it actually is such a sign, then I'm going to find one again once that turn off actually happens and if it's not which it looks like it isn't then i don't really care about it because it's not going to bring me any closer to where we are i don't speak montenegrin so i wouldn't be able to tell if it's just a sign that's like hey this is the name of this small little village or if it's a sign that's like hey you know i don't know children playing around here slow down or, I don't know, make sure you have your winter tires on in the winter. It, I couldn't tell. And even if it was a town name, like, what am I going to do with it? Look through the whole country in the highest zoom level? I'll never find that. Got on the back of the sign. Uh, some kind of religious building. Found that way. Ugh. I'm tired of my <laughs> Yeah, I said if we're lucky, we might find some information. Five or six minutes. I retract the statement. Might take us another hour. But the, the mountain has to end somewhere. Surely. I'll have another look at the valley down there, but yeah, it doesn't, doesn't really fill me with confidence that it'll end anytime soon. Getting closer to that area, though. And we are still mostly um, descending. <laughs> I've definitely run out of things to talk. Yes. I'm aware. But there's just, there's nothing here. What am I supposed to talk about? No. Oh, what do we have here? Velika. Right. I mean, maybe? I'm going to have one quick look because it could relieve me from having to go any further. Oh, there you go. Oh, there's that church. Okay, never mind. We found it. Now, though. <laughs> Now comes a part of where on earth along this road were we? Because we traveled for so far. 
the north going part. We might have, we might be up here somewhere. Or alternatively, we might even be over here. Okay, let me go the other way. Let me see. What's in that direction? I mean, there is a road off here. Should be that. In that case, though. Like, we'd have to have a turn off to the west very soon here, going north. I'll quickly want to check that. I think this is already too far. It can't be it. Although I do think, like, there's a turn off right around here. It turns west, but then does it turn south or does it go back north again? It goes back north, kind of northwest, now north. Right, so is it actually somewhere here? It could be that turn that we just had, and then we go north, and then we'll get to another turn off in the road. I'm going to quickly check that. Uh, this road down here could be that turn off that I was looking at earlier. And then we should get to that U-turn or kind of U-turn over there. And yes, I think we do. But I got to go there to make sure. And see whether... Okay, it's kind of a U-turn. Yes, and there is a house here. I, like, there's no road. Oh, there is a road here. Never mind. Okay. A very small road, but sure. And this one goes around here. We think we're somewhere here. Let me see. It turns west again. It turns around a lot, actually. This is a longer turn. Then we go north, sharp turn, and eventually we'll have that. Okay, so we're somewhere here. Go south. There's this turn. Should be this one. Yeah. And then it should uh, have a sharp turn. Yeah. Okay. We're closer to the north. Though. We should be here. Let's go with that. Yes, we've done it. 25K in Montenegro in 41 minutes, 27. That's not too bad. I'm pretty happy with that. I could have gone on for way longer. And the best thing about it is <laughs> we're now second in the high scores of this Montenegro map. Um, only 2,271 people have played it, but still second place is quite nice for that. And this guy with 6 minutes 30, I mean, either he got the luckiest seed ever. Let me look at his seed. Um, hmm. It doesn't look like a particularly lucky seed. I mean, it doesn't have anything super rural. And there's some intersections there. That does have that, which is pretty rural. So I'm just going to say that was also not even one of his longer times. He spent the longest time here. Which seems odd. I mean, maybe he went south. But still, even like he's a Montenegro specialist, he got super lucky, or he cheated. I don't know which of those uh, which of those options it is, but I'm still I'm happy with my second place with 41 minutes. Um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video, even if at the end there uh, there wasn't really much to talk about anymore. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys again next time. Bye.